There are three primary types of rocket engines, solid fuel, liquid fuel, and hybrid engines that use a combination of a solid fuel source and a liquid or gaseous oxidizer. In this video, I'll be showing how to create a very simple hybrid rocket engine that of all things uses uncooked pasta as the solid fuel source and pure oxygen gas as the oxidizer. To produce the oxygen for this experiment, I'll be relying on the chemical reaction that occurs between two common products, hydrogen peroxide and bread yeast. The natural enzymes in the yeast act as a catalyst that decomposes hydrogen peroxide, causing it to release pure oxygen gas. I'll be reacting the yeast and peroxide together in a small canning jar, with about a 1 8 inch hole punched through the lid to release the oxygen. For safety reasons, a screw-on ring should not be used to hold the lid closed. Without the ring, the lid can easily come off, which makes it impossible to overpressurize the jar, and keeps this oxygen generator very safe to use. The jar is filled about three quarters of the way with peroxide, and a quarter teaspoon or so of yeast is stirred in. This should result in a lot of bubbling as the oxygen is released from the solution. Once the lid is in place, the tiny hole in the center directs all of the oxygen to flow through it. The fuel source, in other words, this large flat-ended pasta that I found at the grocery store, is placed over the hole in the oxygen generator so that the gas is flowing through the center. Now with safety glasses equipped and no fire hazards nearby, the end of the pasta can be ignited. The fire burns steadily through the core thanks to the flow of oxygen coming from the generator. Because of the heavy weight of the oxygen source and the lack of any nozzle to direct the thrust, this engine does not have the power to propel itself into the air, but some of the most advanced rockets in the world are made with the same concept. If you enjoyed this experiment, be sure to share the video with your friends and find more on my YouTube channel, Nighthawk in Light. Thanks for watching.